So why should, why should we make this effort? What is in it for me as a PMO manager? Uh, well, that's a, that's a good question. Um, so really, no, if we, if we, let's, let's, we go reel it back and go way back to PM fundamentals, you know, we're talking about pen box stuff. Um, projects can't succeed as well without executive buy-in and sponsorship. Your, your, your project lives as an entity within a very large organization, most likely. And for that to get a strong foundation, a strong rooting, you've got to have that executive sponsorship. And so all the things we talked about today are, they're not just to help you get things done, but they're also to help build executive sponsorship for your project. And if you're running a a portfolio or a PMO, that's of course even more important to get that executive sponsorship and support. And you, you really need that to make it happen because your project is going to run into issues, your project's going to run into needs and problems, and you're going to need something, some external sponsorship and support to make that happen. And most of the time, our projects don't live in isolation. We span multiple groups, multiple departments, maybe multiple organizations and companies. And so you need that executive sponsorship that can bridge across those um, different departments and teams and maybe organizations to help make you succeed.